Hello everyone, welcome back again to Mufasu Cat channel. Today we are going to learn how to use a NanoCAD construction 2.0. Okay, uh, open your uh, NanoCAD construction. You can double click in icon. I okay, will double click in here. And we are waiting to open NanoCAD construction software. Okay, uh, first uh, I will create a simple sketch with line tools. You can click here line. And I will click at this point. Move uh, to the bottom here. 7000 okay move uh, to drag here 7000 move to the top 7000 and you can click at this point you can press escape button to close this line command we create line again okay you can uh, press shift button hold and right click you can choose a midpoint we'll click at this point next we choose midpoint again and click sort at this point and you can uh, move into here and last we click at this point okay now you can click a construction menu you can click here and i will create walls you can use uh, this option add wall we can create stuff from this point okay move into here move at this point in here and click at this point so it will be automatically correct wall you can press escape button to close we create again wall Okay, from this point, move into here, and click at this point. Okay, we create this uh, path wall with uh, these wall tools. The next, uh, we can create column. Okay, you can uh, click these uh, tools, add uh, column tools. You can create column in here. Okay. And next, at this point. Okay, you can... Uh, use a midpoint and you can click in here for midpoint and next at this point midpoint again okay and click at this point so we already create a column now if you want add door you can use uh, door tools in here door tools and we can click in here like I will set in here into 300 so it will be 300 we create again in here like uh, we can set into 300 okay now uh, you can click this uh, objects and we can move you can click at this point move into here and I will click again you can use orientation men, uh, arrows you can click here to orientation okay we click again at this point we change orientation okay now uh, we can add windows you can click here windows tools like i will click at this point for window okay next in here okay at uh, this point Okay, you also can edit uh, this door tools. You can uh, double click. It will be open a single door uh, dialog box. You can set height and width at this point. Okay. You can click OK to apply. You also can uh, change for uh, Windows uh, dimension by double click on uh, window uh, objects. The next, you can set for height and width. Here, okay. you can click OK to apply. Now uh, you also can add uh, area for room. You can click on this uh, tools room and click uh, insert here. Next, uh, for example, I will uh, change name into room one. Okay, with uh, area, you can click apply and you can click OK. So it will be create room one with area. You can move into this point. This for room one. You also can create another room. Okay, you can click these uh, tools and click inside here. We can set in here into room two. You can click apply and you can click OK. So it's very easy to create uh, text in these rooms. Now uh, we can apply dimension. You can use uh, these dimension tools. Okay, you can click from this point into here to be automatically correct uh, dimension. Okay, we can click to this point but again dimension tools from this point into here 
Okay. You can edit by clicking this uh, vertex into here. We create the dimension from this point into here. Okay. The next at this point. Okay, in here. And from this point into this point. Okay, in here. And the last at this point. Okay. We already created uh, this uh, simple uh, floor plan construction in uh, NanoCAD uh, Construction 2.0. And if you have any question about this uh, simple tutorial, you can comment below this video.